Again, this is continuing Mark Sager, Sager's Team Clean Grand Rapids. What we're doing is using our Butler unit. We're on idle. We have the pressure down low, no chemical injection, of course. Feeding it through the line. We're sucking it back in the tank. We have our lines running into the house. So also, you want to keep the lines up off the floors or you'll get heat signals from the floor. So if you can see that, that's what we force through and we're tapped in. We're tapped into our truck mode. You can see our lines going over here, keeping them off the floor. So suction hose, sucking the water back out to the system and it's a closed loop system typically, keeping that off. We're going down to there. We're tapped into here, suction on the return, feeding in thermal scan you can see what's happening so we can find out what the floor breaks are we're thermal scanning this floor so we can also see where flare-ups are occurring show you a flare-up there's a flare-up flares out more now we've got the line off of here but there are flare-ups there when the water is going and where they're more significant maybe pinholes break holes so that's what we're doing today, and we're trying to help out this client to decide what to do since the house froze up and froze up the in-floor slab heat.